right y'all taking you on another A-Town adventure today I think I need to come out and tell y'all and it's not that you don't already know but from some of the comments I get on some of my videos uh, a lot of the stuff that I go out and do I don't know what I'm doing move you out of the way of the thing there I just go out and do stuff I go out and love to go fishing I'm not any good at it I love to go out and go hunting never killed a deer in my life I try not to give you advice on what to do because I can't stand people that try to tell you a whole bunch of stuff on how to do something and they ain't never done it themselves so I'm trying not to be that guy but today's adventure is we're gonna go with my boys and we're gonna go try to eradicate a white-tailed deer I can't guarantee you that's gonna happen I can guarantee you we, we're gonna try to make it out there we're gonna try to get up in the stand I'm gonna try not to drop the gun off my shoulder 15 foot down the stand again I am gonna try to guarantee you that but what I want to talk to you about on this adventure like I said I am NOT an avid deer hunter never killed a deer can't give a person in the world advice on what to do to do that I can make some stuff up I'm pretty good at lying so but can deer see? Can deer smell? Does it matter what you smell like when you get out in the woods? Does it matter what color you wear? I need to know. Because what I'm doing is wrong. I can tell you that right now. And this will be the first deer hunt I've been on this year. And I haven't been on many in my life. Maybe. Maybe 15. But you get all kinds of information from everybody. I work with a fella. He's already killed a deer this year. I bet he killed five or six of them. Killed five or six of them. Killed. That's a good word, isn't it? I bet he killed five or six of them last year. Harvested is a better word. Uh, but this dude goes and sets in the stand. Don't put on any scent block freaking eats Lance crackers cuts his phone on watches an episode of friends while he's out there just waits for the deer to walk out and he eradicates them. and another fellow I work with same same scenario probably kills three or four a year doesn't harvest more than he needs that sucker camouflages up sprays the no odor scent stuff all over him got his stand completely camouflaged you know with burlap and freaking fake leaves and all kinds of stuff they both swear by their own way they hunt the guy that eats the lance crackers watches tv makes a shit ton of noise doesn't care about his smell he says deer are stupid they don't know what they're doing they just want to eat your corn when they come out to eat your corn you shoot that sounds good the other guy swears up and down, deer smell you. As soon as you make a noise, they're gonna hear it. You better not go in anywhere to there's smoke. If you're a smoker, you ain't never gonna kill a deer. See, y'all give me some info. Give me some input on this, man. Like I said, I'm just heading out. Plus, I'm also driving down the road, talking to a camera. Is it safe? Of course it's not, idiot. It's not safe at all, but we're still doing it. And when I get in a wreck or get a ticket or whatever happens, it'll be my fault and I'll take the blame for it. I'm not blaming you. I just want your opinion on uh, what's it like. Not necessarily what is it like. I want your opinion on what, what you think the best way to go deer hunting is. Should you go completely stealth, cover your scent up, put the freaking face paint on? Like I say, I'm going out there with a rifle. That sucker's 200 yards away. I'm going to take a shot. I'm not out there with a bow. I don't know how to bow hunt. I don't even know how to shoot a bow. I probably couldn't shoot my truck with a bow from 20 feet away from me. Well, no, honestly, I'd probably be lucky to hit a deer at 60 yards away with a freaking 30-30. But we're going to try it anyways. 
like I said, in this video, in all my videos, I don't claim to know what I'm doing. I'm just out living, just trying to out, trying to go out and have a good time, trying to provide meat for my family. But y'all shoot them comments, light them comments up. Let me know your thoughts. Let me, and we'll, we'll, I'll come back and make another video on the comments. You know, be like a a poll. Like a voting system which one works better because like you say i get all kinds of information from everybody oh man you need to do this oh man you need to do that you need to walk in with dopey on your shoes so they can't track you you know another guy said you know just you need to do all kinds of stuff bro. but one guy told me he said what you need to do adam is you need to get out there on the land about three days before you hunt He's like, cover a spot where the deer are coming in at with baking soda and maple syrup and then put sugar daddies everywhere. I was like, what the hell are you talking about? He's like, sugar daddies, you know, the little candies you eat that are like sticky. I was like, caramel. You're talking about the little caramel candies. He's like, yeah. I was like, you're telling me deer are going to come in to get a, I don't know, high carb product that you know you can get at food line and big lots and all that stuff is that's what i'm telling you i was like so what's the deal with the baking soda and the maple syrup and and all that oh they love that they love that put salt down too i was like so you need you're telling me to make a big like land biscuit go out there and make a big land biscuit is what you're telling me and he's like i ain't even gonna talk to you anymore about this I, okay i appreciate it appreciate the information that sounds dumb as shit but anyways i don't know man y'all hit them comments let me know what you think let me show you this drunk guy in front of me this son bitch is everywhere where are you going buddy where are you going i just know what i'm doing ain't working I do know I can't sit still. I am, I may am guilty of that. I do know that probably is a problem. But anyways, I done talked y'all to death. Getting ready to make a turn, head out to my dad's for a minute, see him, hook up with my boys, and then we'll cut the camera back on once we hit the hunting property. Get back at you when I get back at it.